has gone is Neil for CarlightCleaner.com. So this is my off season. It's now January 2022. Uh, it's like 37 degrees outside. <laughs> Tomorrow morning it's going to be like 28 degrees. Uh, I thought, actually, I thought I'd seen 23 degrees on the forecast. So this is really the time of season where, you know, I just take the rest of the season off as far as the winter is concerned. Um, but I just thought I put together this video because I want to be able to just kind of discuss the opportunity in doing headlight restoration as, as a source of income. And when I say that it's a means of income, I don't really mean to say that this is something that you can do probably for the rest of your life. Because probably chances are you're not going to do this <laughs> for the rest of your life unless you really love doing it. Uh, it is a, uh, a field of uh, service that you can provide that will bring you extra income. And there's no doubt about it. Um, mobile headlight restoration service is something that is, is I think is very um, unsung <laughs> as far as really making income because you can you can make income but I never mean to portray to anyone that this is an occupation that you can get rich doing uh, this is not an occupation that you'll get rich doing this is just a profession that you can do to provide extra income okay for yourself for your family and that's really all this is you will definitely make money uh, once you learn the skills of doing mobile headlight restoration and you can learn this in two weeks time. You can uh, make your business cards, put your magnetic sign on your car, uh, you know, build up a word of mouth reputation of what you do to restore headlights. You know, hand out your business cards. Your friends will tell their friends, your relatives will tell their relatives, and you, you know, you have income doing this. Uh, if you know how to advertise on YouTube, on the Google uh, advertisement as well, on Facebook uh, for your particular town and county, uh, you'll get business. You know, you list yourself in the Google profile, which used to be called Google Map. You know, you will get business, okay? So, I mean, these are things that I do in which I don't necessarily pay money to advertise. I have paid money to advertise, but I find that you know, it's more profitable for me to just do it organically, you know, do the SEO techniques uh, on your own website, do the SEO techniques when you post yourself in uh, social forums. And that's things that I've done because I don't like spending money <laughs> as far as advertising is concerned, because in some cases you really have to know what you're doing when it comes to buying ads. Uh, especially if you're doing on Facebook, because a lot of times I have found that you really don't get as much clientele response doing that. So I don't like having to spend more money than I make money. So, but I've been doing this for like since night, I don't want to say 19, <laughs> it ain't that long ago, but I've been doing this since 2014. Okay. So it's, it's been five years, I suppose, five, six years I've been doing this. And um, so I've had the website just that long. So, you know, it's going to at least take you a year or two before your website starts getting recognized by Google. And then, you know, people start going to it, finding it, and then contacting you. So I wasn't that great at SEO, okay? And I'm okay doing SEO, but there are guys who know how to do it better than me. And sometimes if you find those services for those guys to do those SEOs for your website, you know, help to promote it, uh, they offer those services. If they offer you a reasonable rate, uh, you can do that, you know, and you, you'll, you'll probably start off getting more clients than I did when I started, okay? But just to let you know, I mean, I'm in my 60s, okay? I'm retired, <laughs> so um, I get SSI, so I don't, I don't really need to... Uh, make a lot of money doing this but I love the ideal that you know I can make money on the side I love the ideal of you know teaching others how to do this and um, sure you know yeah it's, it's just little things that I do with my website it's still gonna help me financially but I'm gonna tell you right now I'm not wealthy and I ain't getting rich doing this okay so 
this is just something that as an alternative that you can do and you will make money. Now, you can go look at these income opportunity, you know, jobs. Well, I wouldn't even say jobs, but income opportunities that you see in these uh, social websites, you know, uh, getting involved with, you know, Bitcoin or getting involved with uh, selling on uh, uh, your products on Amazon, drop shipping, you know, network marketing. You can try getting in all that other stuff, okay? And there's guys who are making money doing that. But I'm going to tell you right now, those guys who are successful doing those things, they've been doing it for years and they have a audience, okay? They have a huge audience. You know, you see those guys on YouTube. They have like almost six figure subscribers, okay? Because some guys got a million subscribers, okay? So every time they put out a video and they post about something that, you know, they're going to make money with, you know, through uh, uh, Amazon affiliate or something, they're going to make money. Because over, out of a million, okay, maybe about 2,000 will probably look at what they're talking about and say, hey, I want to get that product so I can get started doing this. And 2,000 times maybe $30, $30 okay, of commission. You know, 2,000 times 30, I mean, they are making money, okay? But understand, it didn't happen overnight, okay? So the thing I don't like about embarking upon those type of income opportunities is that by the time you get to the point where they're at, you're going to spend a lot of money. I mean, you're going to spend thousands of dollars, and you know. So uh, before you start breaking even and start making a profit, you, you're going to spend thousands, okay? And if you're not careful and you're on a family budget and you try to rush that thing, you know, dump money into it, you know, listen to these guys upgrade, buy this, buy this package, buy that package, you know, you could, you could get in trouble with your relationship, with your family, with your wife. You might find yourself in divorce court. <laughs> <laughs> so, so you got to be careful about those opportunities. I've been there, done that, okay? Not that I got the divorce because of it. I'm still with my wife, but just to let you know, just to let you know, if you want to be able to embark on something that will make you money and you don't have to spend a lot of money doing it to get started, mobile headlight restoration is a side hustle that you can do. Now, there's other side hustles, too. There's another guy on the YouTube channels. He's a black guy, and he talks about doing, um, you know, appliance repair, you know, mobile appliance repair. 